My name is Amanda Cohen, and I am the chef owner of Dirt Candy, which is an all vegetable restaurant in New York City. Vegetables are delicious. We want to make food fun here. We don't think going out to eat should be serious, but mostly we really, really want to celebrate vegetables. When I decided to open Dirt Candy, I looked around and I was like, oh, there's hundreds of steak restaurants and hundreds of fish restaurants and there isn't a single restaurant dedicated just to vegetables. And that blew my mind because there's so many different kinds of vegetables and they're so beautiful and there's so much you could do with them. If you don't think of vegetable as sort of either you can eat it raw or you can eat it roasted, and if you think, oh, I can puree it, I can juice it, I can cut it into a different shape so I don't recognize it, all of a sudden, it's 10 different things, it's just not one thing. That's the thing, you can do everything with vegetables and you can do so much more than you can even do with meat. I look at a head of broccoli and I don't think, oh, let's just cut that into florets and steam them or stir fry them. I think that can be a hot dog. So we pull off all the florets till there's one left and then you have the stock and then we smoke it, grill it, and then we put it in a homemade bun with really delicious mustard sauce and some broccoli sauerkraut and it tastes like a hot dog. Well, like a broccoli hot dog. Why is it dirt candy? You know, at the time that I was naming the restaurant, one name, restaurants were really popular, like spoon or fork or table. And the first thing I thought was, oh, that's kind of boring, but also impossible to Google, right? If you put spoon <laughs> into Google, you're gonna get like a million different definitions of it and links to it. So I wanted a name that would really stand out and I wanted something that would really represent what we were trying to do when we were thinking about vegetables and what they meant and for me they're basically like candy from the earth and so earth candy didn't sound so fun but dirt candy kind of sounded fun so we went with it. Being a female chef and a vegetarian chef, those are two sort of strikes against you in this industry. We weren't celebrated as much as the male chefs. The media really paid a lot of attention to the male chefs. And being a vegetarian chef, well, nobody cared about vegetarians. It wasn't considered a real cuisine. And, and over the last couple of years, you've seen a lot more chefs get into vegetable cooking and they're opening vegetarian restaurants. So now a vegetarian uh, restaurant is considered a real restaurant. I always compare myself at the beginning of opening Dirt Candy uh, a bit to Ginger Rogers. I'm dancing in high heels backwards. But I think it's changing, slowly, especially for female chefs. We're starting to get more recognition. The food media is uh, more aware of its biases than it was, and so it's opening up its writing. We're not, we're not on parity yet, but we're closer than we were a couple of years ago.